Hey, what's going on, guys? Seven Ian here. Today we're back with episode five of Semi Fallout. All right, so today we're working on a big reactor here. We're smacking this bad boy right in the middle of the floor here, and we're gonna see if we can hook up the power generate like the. Uh, so we got a HE RF to HE converter, so we can power all these machines, which is also very important. We could also have a cable running down to the bottom room here, which would might have like a lot of um, of the uh, batteries uh, storage cell things so, uh, actually no never mind that's not gonna work actually that would work for no I don't think it mm, I'm trying to I'm having trouble deciding if, yeah it would work if you probably do it like over here so if we're gonna if we're gonna do it we're gonna have to put it right here run it down through here I have a whole wall of batteries. So, so we got a lot of storage cells from uh, those radio stations. So that's our basic idea. Put it into there and do. -do. All right. So first things first. We're gonna. We also moved everything, so now we can like. It's somewhat more organized. As I proceed to organize more. Alright, so we gotta look for our radioactive chest. Which radioactive chest. Be like, hmm, so we got this. We got some in here too. Gotta be quick with this because it's radioactive. I uh, keep forgetting there's a big giant hole in my freaking floor. Out of my inventory. Out of my inventory. Okay, we're gonna smack this one over here for now. So basically, we're gonna surround it with this. Surround it with iron. I don't even know if we're gonna have enough to make this big reactor. Why did I put that back in my inventory? That <laughs> potato. Right. Make our job somewhat easier. I think we have builders wanting one of these. There we go. I mean, you can make this a lot smaller, but, like, what's what fun is in a small reactor? More power, baby! We need more power! Uh, that's up to speed on uh, nuclear power generation. Which I almost, I have almost got my stuff stuck in here, so that's, that's fun. <laughs> Alright, look at that. That's coming together real nicely. Probably gonna need like almost another stack, maybe, maybe not. Yeah, we're gonna need another stack for the roof. We're gonna have all the control rods in the middle here, and we're gonna have water surrounding that. So we're gonna have like five control, four or five control rods. We're gonna have four. That's kind of small. Don't mind me just gonna dig a little freaking door here. Aye. So we gotta make another. F we don't need a whole entire stack. What we should do is start making more of the. Uh, control rods. Just in the crafting recipe already. We're gonna need like. So if it's four blocks high. We need, uh, 12. We're gonna need 12. Just enough. Look at that. Quick maths. Quick, real quick maths. I'm gonna get two more out of this. Two more stacks. All right. I think that's that's all we can make right now. All right. That's that should work. Now we need water and quite a lot of it. Stuff blows. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna need a lot more than four, aren't we? <laughs> I'm dumb. 
Actually, no, I was right. Never mind. <laughs> Me second my guessing myself. Okay, look at that. So we're gonna have the uh, the control rod thingies on top. Oh, I hate when it does that. Here we go. We need control rods and uh, reactor access ports. <laughs> We're gonna make control rods first, which is basically. Oh goodness, I'm gonna need more coal. I don't have any more coal, do I? Oh, there we go. Divide the stack. I have to say, this is all pretty useful. <laughs> Next, we're going to make an electric press. Burner press. I'm going to detox myself here. <laughs> this is really an interesting placement for a reactor, really. Like, you wouldn't run a re nuclear reactor right in your base, but here I am. Huh, it's fine. Though, mind you, this is a reactor that won't blow up and uh, destroy everything. Alright, so next thing we're going to do... is I know we have some mechanism... Or alloy thingy, my robber. Advanced alloy. And no one of these chests. I thought I did, anyway. Oh, I know where it is. And combine that with our steel that we have. I still don't know where it is. I'm dumb. I lost it. Hmm. It disappeared. Uh, dang, I can't make a tank now. Unless I make more. We can also, I think we also have an R, R, uh, HE to RF converter. Actually, I don't need that. Never mind. Hmm. Actually, we will need it for the uh, this power storage options that we're going to have. Hmm. I can't, what the frig, I had like four of those advanced alloys from, from mechanism. lost that now. You know what? Whatever. I'm not meant to have it. Okay, so we got that smelted down. More in uranium. Uranium. Okay. Control rods. We're gonna need four of those. Pretty cheap. All of them. <laughs> need redstone. I need an ME system too. Wireless one so I can just click it and boom, it's there. Alright, we got all four control rods. We're gonna smack these bad boys up here. Hmm. All right, so we're gonna. F Oops, I did. I. Oof. Oof. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna surround the top here. This is just a rough idea here. Make sure we have enough for everything. Now we need input input ports and stuff, which means we're gonna have to get more. More iron. <laughs> oh no. I did not consider about. Okay. There we go. Then we need a controller, which is pro uh, probably expensive. Yeah. I can't say I'm not surprised. 
because I'm, I'm really not. Okay, so we're gonna have to make more like coal or something. Why do I need so much coal? Look how big this actually kind of looks cool, I guess. In a weird uh, industrial way. Me and the boys at 3 a.m. looking for coal. I wonder if you can use this. Oh, that would have been nice. It looks like coal. Very brown coal. <laughs> Me trying to reason here. Ooh. Dang, I don't have any more coal. That's tough. Pretty sure you can just smelt this down. Okay, so we're gonna need more, uh, more iron, which we have very little of now. <laughs> Reactors are expensive. It's fear not, because we have a solution, which is these lovely, oh, these lovely centrifuges. I freaked up three times now. <laughs> Unacceptable. It actually kind of matches the uh, like the rest of the dark like theme that's going on here. There hasn't been a single storm in like three days. I'm kind of concerned. No, oh, that that looks pretty nice. Everything is pretty much organized. Mm, I forgot to throw them in my. Mm. Can you use charcoal? Please say you can. Oh, that's sweet. That is sweet. So we can use charcoal for the reactors as well. Come on, give me four, baby. One more. Alright, there we go. We also need a diamond. We only have one. I think that's something. That's good because we only need one controller. We need redstone, which we already have. I'm, I, I'm so glad we can use uranium for that because we have like a lot of that. Oh, I forgot the very important step here. Just making the case first. It somehow has nuclear stuff in it already. Ping. <laughs> Ping. Alright, so now we put the uranium on the sides. Put that in the middle. Put that there. Missing something. Oh, yeah, diamond. There we go. Reactor controller, and we need an input and an output. And so we're gonna need a piston, cobblestone. So I have more than one crafting. Why is there one at every single crafting table? Ridiculous. <laughs> I put one on every single crafting table. Right. Don't mind me Just trying to figure this out. Do, do, do. Can't get that. I am brain dead. E. I need another chest. I think we have one. I don't even know why they're looking for these things. This is not where they're. Oh, I do actually have one. Huh, look at that. Alright, so we need access ports, both in and out.
Yeah, I don't, uh, does this take anything radioactive? That's a first if it doesn't. Reactor access ports. So we put our chest in here. Pushy boy. I have enough to make one. <laughs> no, this sucks. And the crafting continues. All right, so we're getting a. This should be enough. One more big guy. I never realized how how uh, useful having three crafting tables would be. Go. I don't, think, I don't think we need more than two. Oh, never mind. I forgot we need to make a p access power access port too. This is not cheap. Not to mention we don't even have fuel in this bad boy yet. It's a little bit of fuel that we have. All right, we got the piston, redstone. No, not redstone. Just. We got that. Now we need a power tap, which is the cheapest fucking thing. Just too expensive. We don't need one of these bad boys. All right, here we go. Let's start uh, putting these in. Alright, power tap's gonna go in this wall here. Controller's gonna go over here. Actually, put that right there. Or I have the power. I'm gonna have the power on the side here. Not the power, but the uh, input and output. Have this connected to a chest. I need a wrench now. Stupid. Oh, that's a coolant port. I was wondering what that was. Do I need a coolant? Uh, no, I don't need coolant ports since it's uh... Yeah, I don't need a coolant port since it's only the reactor itself and not the turbine running with it. Alright, now what we need to do is we need to take off the top here and put some water in here. A lot of water. That's the fun part. Oh, why does he keep dropping down there? Stupid. Let's jump down here, get it, and hop back out again. So we're just going to be using normal water for now. It's not the best, but... Oh, we're going to a pinch. Buckets. Buckets. Bucket. I need another bucket. Ooh. Could make an infinite water source and then uh, slap all that down. At least we don't have to go too far to get water. I was gonna use an HBM uh, reactor, but that's got too much risks. At least you know this one won't blow up when it feels like it. <laughs> or if, like, if you mess something up. <laughs> That's literally what happens uh, if you mess something up, like if it does runs out of coolant or something. Boom! Everything irradiated. And that doesn't that does that is just not nice. Okay, we got a nice little uh, base here. Oops. Up the stairs. 
stairs again, and now. Container water. I have to use an infinite water source here. I said infinite, damn it. Put everything else in the inventory. Anything that's not essential. Make sure all of these are freaking covered in water. We might upgrade it later. We might not. Who knows? Like, we might get Jillid Carithium eventually. That's, that's gonna be expensive, though. Have to make a mob duplicator. <laughs> make a farm out of that. I think it's the Blitz. Or something. I think that's what that's called. Weird little... sure it's absolutely perfect. We're trying not to be like Chernobyl here and have a nuclear reactor failure. NBK reactors can never fail. <laughs> Alright. Now. Put the roof on. I gotta see why it's not assembling. Top can't be here. Okay, so let's put it up here. Hey, it worked! It's alive! <laughs> Alright, now, fun part. Is turning this thing on. I think we can just click on this. Oh, yeah, you can also change it so we don't have to make a wrench. So that's output, this is input, so we can make a chest. Uh, I want to see if uranium would actually work in here. <laughs> I know that's a stupid, it's probably not going to work, but I want to see if uranium would work in here. It's because you can use uranium to build it, can you put uranium to power it? If so, I have quite a lot. Oh, it's, it's making me a bit queasy. Oh shit. <laughs> I'm dying. Okay. Well, let's, um, let's find out. Oh, it works. That's cool. Oh, that's cool. You know what that means, right? More power, baby. <laughs> uh, all right, let's activate this bad boy. RF is going up, man. Look at that. We got more power than what we could possibly need right now. How much? Po oh, yeah, we got. Hmm. It's quite a lot. We don't have to worry about this thing exploding either. Like, uh, hmm. Certain other stuff. Let me slap this up here. Hmm. That's gonna go into, uh, hmm. Okay, so we got that war power, baby. Alright, so next we need to grab our copper or coated wires. I think that's what it is. I'm looking for those and I cannot find those. We also gonna need this. Copper colored wires, where are you? Can't find my copper colored wires, what the fuck? I know I have more. Ah, there they are. Alright, next. Next is the uh, part where we uh, make a battery room. Store all this unlimited power. Hehe. <laughs> all right. So basically, it's gonna slide down here. It's gonna go in here. to a feed into a big wall of batteries here.
Oh, oh, okay. I see. I see what's good. This will be our backup just in case, like, we lose power. Oh, man, that's filling it up quick. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're going to have a lot of power in case of a power failure or something like that. Not like that would happen anyway, let's be honest here. <laughs> More power, baby. Big, big boy reactor. <laughs> That's great. Oh, man. That's how you make a big reactor in Minecraft. <laughs> we could use uranium with it, too, which is the funny part, because, like, it's not even the same mod. Casing heat's pretty low, actually. Why is it so low? <laughs> Interesting. I don't know if that's good or not. <laughs> Just the fact that we can use uranium in here, though, that's the funny part. Like... <laughs> That's cool. All right, so we got more power, baby. Look at this big boy, big boy. G to RF converter. I don't know. Yeah, we can put that. We need more copper. More copper cables. I can spell cables. Okay, that looking. Ooh, that look good enough. Yeah, you know what? Never mind. That's not gonna. I'm not gonna make that anytime soon. Insulators aren't too expensive, but still. Anyway, that's it for this episode. Episode five of uh, semi-fallout. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.